How's it going everybody? Just wanted to do a uh, really quick update. I'm just using my phone instead of my camcorder. Uh, it's gonna be real quick. I didn't feel like getting the camcorder ready just for a quick video. Uh, but I was shooting my GW2000 today. Um, probably don't even have 200 rounds through the gun. All I brought was uh, one box of shells and you know I had some other guns I was shooting. And uh, I didn't even make it through a full box today. Uh, I had maybe like six left. And uh, the gun unfortunately broke on me. I don't know what happened. I shot two rounds and um, unloaded it. Went, went to go try to finish the rest of the box of ammo. And I could not lock the uh, the barrels into the action, into the receiver. Uh, they would not lock at all. So I don't know what is going on. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to try to find out you know, what I can do. Uh, obviously, it's broken. Uh, it's kind of unfortunate for not even having 200 rounds through the gun that's already broke uh, within a couple months. Um, and everything all I shot was just bird shot. I'll show you uh, best I can. Like I said, it's my phone, so it's not the most stable, but it's unloaded. Try to close it. And you can see the lever is still way over here when it should be more in the middle. Go ahead and try a little bit harder. So, it's definitely broken. Uh, I don't know what it can be, like I said. I did try to take the, uh, I did take the uh, side plate and uh, some of the other parts off to see if I can see anything. Uh, I couldn't see anything. Uh, it's unfortunate. I tried taking, taking the uh, trigger group assembly out, but I couldn't figure out why it wasn't coming out. I didn't see any other screws. I didn't want to break nothing, so I just put it back together. But, uh, so yeah. Uh, I'm going to try maybe tomorrow, I'm not sure, uh, take it back to uh, Dunham's, my local Dunham's is where I bought it at, and uh, see what they have to say. Uh, I would kind of almost would hope to uh, maybe get my money back because it's not looking good for this gun for breaking within a couple months with not even 200 rounds of bird shot through it. And, uh, you know, I don't want to have to do it, but I really like the gun for the money, but if it's not going to work work real good you know if it's already broke it's not really you know saying anything good about the gun so far um if i can't get my money back which i'm kind of hoping uh kind of want to look for towards and maybe use that money towards the uh, smith and wesson mp uh full size 45 um uh, i need another 45 to the collection <clears throat> so maybe i can get my money back from this like i did with my Wasser 10 you know, they actually gave me credit back on the gun after Century fixed it and brought it back and it's still jamming. So maybe they'll do the same for this, you know, just say, hey, I don't want the gun, you know. Maybe I can get my money back, which, like I said, which is kind of what I'm hoping. And maybe I'll uh, put one of those on layaway, one of those M&Ps. So I uh, get something that I really want and that should definitely last a lot longer than this thing. Uh, but so that's a quick update. You know, it's kind of unfortunate. And again, I don't know what what could cause it to not lock anymore. I didn't, nothing was out of the ordinary, excuse me, uh, nothing was out of the ordinary. Uh, so I don't know what the deal is, but, but that's it. That's the update. Uh, thanks for watching and have a good one.